And let me ask you today, what's your past been? Painful, pleasant, a little bit of everything. Hey, he can use it. You have a part to play. You have a role to fulfill. Think about it. Theistic evolution is a lie from the pit of hell. That God created everything, and now he's cold and distant, doesn't care about anything, and he's like this great big free-range sheep rancher, and people are being born, and it's like, I'll leave you alone, I'll come back in a couple thousand years, and I'll round up who's left. God is not like that. Before God made anything, he knew you. And he wrote your book, your name in a book. Think about that. And it says that you were created in Christ Jesus for good works, which he has prepared for you. I love that, don't you? I get so excited about that. You know why? God can handle it. Whenever I think of the universe and all the stars going down to, you know, the Grand Canyon and you can really see the Milky Way late at night and you can almost reach up and grab it and you go, this is crazy. I just blinked my eyes and the sun lost 600,000 tons of mass. The Bible says he hangs the stars on nothing and he calls them by name. And the scientists have just figured out he hangs them on nothing. They just don't know he hasn't called them by name yet. <laughs> when I think about that, listen, you know, you know what gets me excited about that is that it says he loves me. And if he can handle all of that, he can control things for me. And if he's created you and I, and he has in Christ Jesus for good works, which means before you were born, he goes, oh, I know you. I know you, Richard. I've, I've got a plan for you. Oh, man, I've got some things you're going to do. I know he can get me to it. I just need to be filling my mind with what he says. In those moments when everything's crazy and it doesn't make sense, I just got to go, okay, God, I know you know what you're doing. When I can't quite figure it out, Lord, I know, you know, these things aren't working against me. I look how you use Esther. I look how you use Joseph and Jacob and Daniel and Moses and Deborah. And the list goes on. Ah, oh, you've got your hand on them. Hey, what about you? <laughs> 